Okay, in this video, we're going to look at creating an anchor and then creating a hyperlink to the anchor. So an anchor is basically a position within your web page that you can create a link to so that you can create a navigation to a page that's a place that's already on your page. So on this question, it says place the anchor, uh, replace the text place anchor here with an anchor called top. So that's what I'm going to do firstly. So here's my web page. This is it in the design. So here's the text place anchor here. I'm just going to do it in the code. So I'm just going to highlight that text and go to insert named anchor and type the name of my anchor top and OK. And it's now put this code in its place. So if I go to my design, you'll see a tiny little anchor icon there, which won't be visible in your actual web page. So that's the code that you should have. Then it says that um, the text click here to return to the top of the page. Um, only the words click here should be a hyperlink to the anchor that we just created. So I need to look for that. So if I go into my design, it's down here. So it's not, it's further down somewhere. I'm just going to go into my code and have a look for it. Okay, so here it is. Click here to return to the top of the page. So only the words click here are my hyperlink. So I'll just highlight those and then go to insert hyperlink. And in the link bar, you should find the anchor that we just created and that's it. It should have a hash in the beginning. And then if I press OK, that's now created a link to the anchor called top. So if I, um, I'll just save this. If we have a look in the browser at this, okay, um, so if I just scroll down, say I'm here and I go click here, you see it's just a slight movement but it's actually moved up. If this was a, a website that was very long, then it would be useful to have an anchor at the top of the page that you could have a link to at the bottom of the page that so would move up to the top without you having to scroll up. So if I press click here again, you should see that it's moved up to the top of the page and in the web address you'll see that there's our anchor there because that was the last action we completed so when we clicked it looked for the anchor which is up here at the top of the page and moved up so that's how that works